Yo, YouTube, we're back again with the very first episode of our Heart Gold Randomized Nuzlocke Challenge. And I will let y'all know, y'all came through in the voting, in the in the comment section, and uh, the votes were kind of close. I'm not going to lie to you. There, there were two of them that was very, very close. Uh, one of them was, uh, it was a surprise to me that it didn't get but a couple of votes. And that was, uh, well not gonna tell you just yet let's jump into the game and uh let's pick our starter and see who uh who we're rocking with today all right so ladies and gentlemen let's uh walk on over here and let's officially meet our first teammate of the playthrough now Roserade had the least amount of votes which i was very surprised about and I'm not going to lie to you. When I said I had a preference, Roserade was the one I was talking about. I thought Roserade was going to be a powerhouse to start the game out with. And I really wanted Roserade. Unfortunately, that did not happen. Now, moving to Darkrai, I saw a legendary. I got hyped. I got excited. And I was like, shit. He has a terrible move set. It's absolutely garbage. This is not a mon that we want to start the game off with. So I was, I was kind of hoping chat would lean away from that thankfully y'all did uh and coming in as our winner it is the one and only powerhouse the normal type zangoose now i am not mad at this zangoose has really high attack stat and uh he typically typically has a very diverse move set i will be completely honest i don't remember if uh <laughs> if i put a uh, random move set or ability on here now zangoose needs a nickname and this one and only nickname let's what is a good nickname for a zangoose i feel like ripper is is a ripper is that gonna fit ripper I, th I think ripper sounds good he's got the claws he looks mean i like it ripper ripper the zangoose is officially on the squad now Back to Professor Elm. Mm. Uh, let me get my voice ready. <clears throat> uh, how do you like walking with your Pokemon? It's not bad, is it? You take it uh, all the way to your Pokemon house? Is your If your Pokemon gets hurt, you should heal it with this machine. It's easy to use. Just check the PC on my desk. Uh, Mr. Pokemon goes everywhere and finds rarities. His house is past Cherry Grove City. Go north uh, pa a little past Cherry Grove. I'm counting on you, Riddler. Sweet. Now, ladies and gentlemen, the Nuzlocke has not officially started. The Nuzlocke starts when I get Pokeballs. So, I don't believe I get Pokeballs until I go to uh, Mr. Pokemon and come back. We'll see how that goes. So, that means if uh, Zangoose dies, we don't lose the run yet. Oh, Riddler, I want you to have these to help you with your task. You obtain potions. Good old little Podions. Potions are, are very, very, uh, very handy. Don't hesitate to use potions if you think you're in danger. Oh, I promise you in this playthrough, potions are going to be my best friend. Y'all ain't got nothing to worry about when it comes to potions. Oh, uh, do I got to do a female voice right now? I wasn't prepared. Riddler! So you pick Zangoose. That's a cute Pokemon you have. When you walk with it, it'll become more friendly. You should turn around and talk to, your, uh, talk to it sometimes, too. Oh, that's right. Why don't you show it to your mom? See ya! You thought I was just going to leave on my Pokemon journey without go, going and visiting moms? Nah, bro. That ain't how this works. We got the we got the powerhouse Ripper back here. I'm going to call him Jack the Ripper just because. Because he'll be out here sleety slicing everybody. <laughs> oh, Riddler, that's a cute Pokemon you have. Professor Elm must have given it to you. Oh, Professor Elm has a task for you, you say. What kind of task? I see. That sounds a little difficult. But when uh, someone makes this kind of request, it uh, must be important. That's right, I completely forgot. Your Pokegear came back from the repair shop. Here you go. Riddler received the Pokegear. I got my gear. I'm ready. I'm ready to become a Pokemon master. Uh, the Pokemon... Whoa, oh, I just had a brain in yours. I'm sorry. Well, Pokegear, as often as uh, every trainer should have... Guess what, uh, you can use the Poke Gear to make phone calls too. Do you remember how? Yes, I do. Just power the Poke Gear and touch the telephone button, okay? 
I promise you, I will be ignoring everybody's calls like I do in real life. <laughs> all right let's move on let's start the journey now like i said the nuzlocke does not officially begin until look at this little asshole up here i'm gonna beat you like a red-headed stepchild when you take a pokemon uh, wait one second come on professor come on i'm trying to go and and do your task right now i almost completely completely forgot about this here i'll give you my number that wasn't necessary, bro. I'm not going to answer your phone call. I'm sorry. You can send straight to the box. Like some of these trash Pokemon in the game. Alright, so Route 29. This will give us a little bit of a perspective of what we're going to be encountering. That could be our first encounter when we get... Ooh. I would not be mad at a Skarmory. I would not be mad at that at all. A nice steel flying type off the rip. That would... That would be nice. Now, I know y'all can't see the bottom screen at the current moment. I am going to be working on fixing that, so please bear with me. Uh, but we don't have a random moveset or ability at the moment. Um, I didn't randomize that. Uh, this is the first time I've ever played a game in in this regards, doing a Nuzlocke challenge type, uh, type of deal. So let's uh, have some fun and just kind of play along, see what happens. But Skarmory, oh, I've, I really feel like Skarmory would be a good addition to the team. Now, I, with that being said, Skarmory, Skarmory could be a powerhouse. I don't remember what the order of the gems are in this. In this, I think is it Bugsy? Is Bugsy is Bugsy first, or is he third? I don't remember. I know Bugsy. Bugsy is a pain in the ass. Come on, get it. Whoa, that hurt a lot. Why that hurt so damn much? All right, so we're going back to heal off rip. Uh, even though the Nuzlocke has not started yet, I'm I'm going to be treating it as if it did. I don't want one step into the grass. <laughs> I, I'm I'm going to utilize the speed up button in situations like this, especially for grinding the uh, grinding levels and stuff. And yes, I might be cheating just slightly in this regards to where I, I you know I could get whatever Pokemon I want. Or, uh, I can see whatever I want, but this also gives me some levels. Some easy, I won't say easy because obviously he only has normal type moves. That's not exactly the best moveset in the world. Omanite wouldn't be bad either. Omanite's not bad. I mean, it would suck to have it and not evolve until, you know, level, I think it's 40 when it evolves, 35 or 40. I don't remember. But that, that part would suck, but... He's got a decent typing, especially for this game. Omanite might not be a, a bad pickup either. Hey, I don't know what what nature Ripper is right now, but uh, I, I don't think he's in attacking nature. Then again, he did use a withdrawal, so that makes defense higher. But hurry up, come on. We need these levels. We gonna go through here. We gonna uh, kick ass and take names. I'm a little upset that the Pokemon community, or not Pokemon community, that the people at Pokemon have not done something with Zangoose and uh, a Dragonair? Bro, oh, it's gonna have Dragon Rage. We're gonna test this right now just so I know if I need to run once we get Pokeballs. If it has Dragon Rage, it's an instant death. And I don't wanna risk the run. The, the run on the hopes of a Dragonite later on in uh, later on down the road, the line. That wouldn't be too bad. Well, all it used was wrap, so we might be okay. Might be all right. Maybe I don't trust it. I, I really feel like a Dragonite or a Dragonair would be a problem. And then I gotta train the Dragonair until level 55. Is it 55 or 50? Might be 55. I don't remember. Um, one of the rules I did not go over in the very first episode was the, uh, the shiny claws, which, you know, I don't, I didn't raise any of the shiny, uh, any of the shiny chances or anything. They're all the exact same as they normally would be in this game. But if we run into the shiny, we are perfectly allowed to catch it and it's allowed to go on the team. So that goes for like grinding and stuff. 
Uh, I haven't decided how I'm going to do grinding when it comes to um, recording. If I'm going to record the grinding montage and just speed that up in the video. Or uh, if I'm just going to grind off off screen and then come back. Um, I think that'll be more of a... Y'all let me know in the comments below if y'all would rather watch a grinding montage where I just speed it up, put a music behind it. That way you can be like, oh, please, please don't give me a puzzle. Out of everything over here, you are the absolute worst thing. I would not want you. You would definitely, you would be death fodder. I don't even know if I would train you up. If I'm being completely honest with you. I would not want a plusle. For any reason. Plusle or mining. Both of them are trash. But yeah, if y'all like uh, a grinding montage, just let me know down in the comments below. Uh, just so I know going forward i am going to be adding more stuff to this overlay as i go just to make it look a little bit, a little bit better for everybody let's see let's see we get an apricot nothing there all right all right i want to hit level six really quickly come on i want to hit level six because i don't think i hit level six in that last battle come on on my night it's time to get your shit rocked I did hit level six. Okay, okay. All right, we'll do this, and then we'll we'll keep it pushing up. Because I would like, I would like to be able to get a new encounter in this episode. I'm gonna try and keep these episodes roughly between 25 to 30 minutes long. I don't want to go way too long. I know early in the beginning episodes, these things will happen, but just in case, I, I don't want to go too too crazy with them. Just in case, unless we're in like a, a weird point in the story where we just got to keep on going. I did say I wasn't going to use speed, bu speed up button that much, but I'm going to... This is this is not really too much going on. <laughs> yes, I know. You want me to follow you? You know, show me through the town. I already know what all this is. I knew what all this was before you were programmed. So let's, let's keep it pushing. I know that's where I buy Pokeballs. I'm not going to do that. I'm going to leave Pokeballs off the table until I, I have no choice. Oh, I can... If I, once I get a fishing rod, I'm going to have to remember to come back here and get an encounter. Because that will come in handy. Alright, I have the running shoes now. So, so that, that kind of helps where I ain't got to use speed up button as much. All right, heal my Zangoose up. We're going to make our way up the next route. I believe there's some trainer battles up there as well. Which will come in. It'll be nice to get some more experience. All right, let's go. Come on, Zangoose. Hey, Ripper. We, we out here ripper in these mugs. Got to gotta do everything we can. What is this? Who are you? What's up, Gramps? I forgot about one thing. This is another token for me. Take it. This is the God God get lauded uh what a town map or what the what did I just read? I'm sorry. I, I read something and it just disappeared. I thought I got the map when I came back through. So Route 30, what is some potential encounters we can get up here? Yo, imagine. A map. I will waste all of my Pokeballs on getting this Turtwig. I'm telling you, Turtwig is one of my favorite starters of all time. I will I will literally waste all, I will let Ripper die if that means I get Turtwig. That is, ooh, that's a nice encounter. I hope you're the common encounter up here. Knowing my luck, I won't catch it. I'm, I'm not even gonna lie. My luck, I'll get that as my encounter. Oh, fucking Snorlax, bro. I don't want to see that. As much as I like Snorlax, Snorlax is a absolute monster. But when I tell you he does not like Pokeballs, I'm not doing this. Yeah, I'm, I'm speeding that up for real. Oh, don't die. I was about to say, I, I wasn't about to sit there and Watch the defense curl game. I'm sorry. It's Snorlax. They're bulky as shit. 
and using defense girl on top of that we was gonna be there for a lot, about another 15 minutes just doing that one battle all right come on nurse joy heal me on up we got some things to do so so far that route's got some power i'm a little bit scared of that last route it has fucking it's got plusles on it i'm not i'm not a fan of plusle at all so I'm, I'm hoping not to get that one everything else on that route was was decent oh it had centrance too which considering i'm a normal type already i wouldn't want another normal type but it, it definitely could be worse what's in this house no apricots in this either it looks like it's got a apricot up top what you got for me playboy People usually come to my house looking for Mr. Pokemon's house. You did, uh, you did mean to visit the house, right? How could you? Do you have any apricots? No, I don't have any apricots for you. Oh, are you the Pokeball guy? Oh, oh that's why I couldn't get the apricots, because I didn't have the box. I didn't have the box. So now I can get those. And those, uh, the apricots give you special Pokeballs. See, I was gonna say I thought there's an apricot right there, at the top of the uh, at the top of the tree. I was like, I thought I was tripping, but you gotta have a special the specialty item to get it. Did I go get that item over there on the on the right back there? Low tad's not bad either. I like everything on this route so far. I really want the turtwig, wig, but low tad wouldn't be bad to have either, simply because I don't know. If the if the items are randomized, if I might not find a water stone for you, because Ludicolo is powerful now. I've I've used a, a Ludicolo on a on one of my competitive teams before. Ludicolo is nice. I found a black flute. I feel like the flutes wasn't supposed to be right there, so I definitely feel like maybe the items are random. All right, so let's keep pushing up here. Get to Mr. Pokemon's house. Star you is another powerhouse. Well, not Star you, Star me. Star me is really good. I am not going to lie to you in the in the slightest. My rival that I be battling with all the time, he he whipped out a Star me on me one time. I was like, man, what's that thing gonna do? Swept my whole damn team. That's what it did. I ain't gonna lie to you. Ain't got no reason to lie to you. I was mad. I saw a Star me. I was like, oh, say less. I don't remember what move he used, but he set up one move and then it was just game over for me. From that point on, I don't think I even touched it. All right. So, um, Star Me, Star You, both of them are decent mods. So, I, I wouldn't be mad at that. All right. I think, I think I'm going to just run. I think I'm just going to run from the rest of these. So I don't want to get too overleveled doing all this. Give me the apricot. Give me the apricot. Right. Got a pink one that time. What up, Zan Goose? How you doing, brother? Looks like it wants to lead. Uh, I mean, I don't think you had that ability to do that in this game. Uh, I mean, I apologize, but you know, these things happen. Oh, we got more old people. You must be Riddler. It was uh, I who sent the email to Professor Elm earlier. Okay, what you got for me, sir? This is what I want Professor Elm to examine. I obtained the mystery egg. Togepi. I don't know. I don't think it's Togepi anymore. A friend of mine gave you... A friend of mine from Ecritique gave me it. I bet you can't find any kind of egg in Johto. I thought Professor Elm might be able to tell uh, what this is. He's the best when it comes to research and Pokemon evolution. There's a quote from a famous Professor Oak. You are returning to Professor Elm. Here, the Pokemon should uh, have some rest. Thank you. Zane Goose appreciates that. Oh, shit. Okay, and with that, I'm Professor Oak, a Pokemon researcher. So you're Riddler. I was just visiting my friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running some errands for Professor M, so I waited here. Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon. I see, you must be helping Professor M. Elm's research. I think I understand why Professor Elm gave you that Pokemon. You'll treat the Pokemon with love and care, it seems. Ah, you seem to uh, be quite dependable. Uh, how would you like to help me out? 
See, I have the latest version of the Pokedex that automatically records data on a Pokemon that you've seen or caught. It's very, it's high tech and <laughs> it's a high tech encyclopedia. I'd like you to have it. Thank you, sir. You are generous, a gentleman and a scholar. <laughs> Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and uh, complete that Pokedex. But I've stayed too long. I have to get to Goldenrod for my uh, usual radio show. Riddler, I have a feeling that this is not the last time we'll meet. Thanks for strange numbers to be on the safe side. I'm be real with you, Oak. I'm not answering your phone call. It's just how it is. I hate it. Hate it for you. All right, back, back to the professor. He didn't give me the option to, to, to send him to the box that time. I, I will see I will see y'all momentarily, okay? I, I, I'll see you momentarily. I promise. I, I will be at the house. Liggity split. Not really. Liggity split. I'll be there in a, in, in, in a few. Alright, so I'm guessing Turtwig is the rare encounter on this route, because I only saw it that one time. Which is a little bit of a bummer, but I'm also not too mad at it. Alright, so I did get that item. I don't remember what that item was. I don't recall the item. Okay, well I see Turtwig a second time. Maybe... Maybe we'll get it. I, I, I'm not going to hold my breath on it. But... I will say that is the uh, the most ideal thing I want from this route because I, I need type diversity. I don't need, as much as Snorlax would be great, I don't want Snorlax. Because one, Snorlax has a ridiculous catch rate. It doesn't like staying in Pokeballs. And then his moveset is great. But again, I don't want to sit here and waste every Pokeball on Snorlax when I already have a normal type. So that could pose a, uh, a problem. Same with Centret. I don't... Well, one, Centret's, Centret's ass. So I don't want that. So are you going to have Darkrai? Who, who do you got? I should have did a voice room. I'm sorry. I didn't do a voice room this time. My bad. I just I was clicking through dialogue. Wasn't paying no attention. Champion Landon. You do have Darkrai. Mm. That, my friend, sucks. But you don't have any good moves, so I'm not worried about it. Oh, all you have is disabled. Uh, I'm gonna leer you just in case. Oh, all you have is disabled, so I, I'm just gonna scratch away at you. Cause you can't disable more than one move, so I, you only have disabled. That's gotta. I don't know how we would have. We would have literally had to. <laughs> If we would have picked Darkrai, we would have had to wait until we got an encounter and then swap trained him until he learned a new move. That sucks. Oh, he's mad. He's big mad. Do you want to know who I am? I'm going to be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. I don't think so. You have to contend with me. Give that back. That's my trainer card. Oh no, you saw my name. Yeah, yeah I did. I synced it with my own two eyeballs. All right, let's get back to the, let's get back to the house. We're not gonna do any more battle, ah, oh, damn it. Yeah, we're not gonna do any more battling just yet. I feel like level seven's not, uh, not too bad to be at. Oh, uh, I need to, get to I need to get to doing that I don't know what I was thinking right there get up here and deal with all this extra stuff with Crobat hey 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 hold up Crobat would be legit too now I ain't gonna lie I've I use Crobat in my brilliant diamond shining pearl playthrough it took me forever to get Gobat to like me enough to to you know come with me but <laughs> or uh I <laughs> said said come with me for for go back to evolve. I hate friendship evolutions. <laughs> Who are you? Why are you investigating the case in the missing Pokemon here? 
Oh, rule number one, whoever did it will come back to, uh, to the site. Oh my, so you must be the one who did it. No, I was given everything, all right? Get the fuck out of here. Hold on a second, he has nothing to do with it. I saw it, it was that rare red-headed boy. I mean, <laughs> looking into the building. What? You battled a boy like that? You must be the one that... <laughs> he must be the one that did it. Did you happen to get his name? I did, a matter of fact. And his name was... Wes. My good rival in uh, Pokemon battling and whatnot. He is going to be our rival for in the game. Oh, I see, so his name is Wes. Thanks for helping the investigation. The next assignment will be to search for the red-headed individual. Alright then. Bye. Riddler, uh, I'm glad they understand that you are innocent. See you later. Pointless dialogue. Bye. Uh, Riddler, this is terrible. Oh, yes. This is the Pokemon's big discovery. Hand over the mystery egg. Ooh, mystery egg. Do we get the egg back? Uh, this is the egg, isn't it? The egg is uh, maybe something I, I never see. This is still an egg. Mr. Pokemon has always fantasized about eggs. Well, since he gave it to us, we might as well uh, find out the secret it holds. I'll keep it here for a while and let you know about the egg. Uh, what? Yes, he gave me a Pokedex. Is that true? That That's incredible! He is a superb at uh, seeing the potential in Pokemon trainers. Well, Riddler, I knew you were a little different. Things are going to be fun. Your Pokemon really seem to like you, so why don't you take the uh, Pokemon Gym Challenge? If you manage to defeat all the gym leaders, you'll eventually challenge the Pokemon League champion. Or not. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Becoming the champion is not all that that easy. It can certainly be a challenge. By the city's gym. I mean, listen. I was I was the Pokemon leader before y'all was even programmed. Before y'all were born. Before y'all knew what was going on. It's a long journey. Before you leave, make sure you talk to your mom. I, I want to talk to you because I want my egg back. All right. That's what I want. That's I want my egg. Give me the egg. That's a special encounter. I get to keep him. I get, I'm going to get it regardless. So you're leaving on an adventure. Oh, I hope you too. It could be a little different. Receive prize money and uh, for you. Okay. Yes. So no, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't want you to save my money. Give me my money. Uh, is this about your money? Yes. I have no money saved. I do have money saved. Give me my money back. Oh no no no! I didn't. I didn't give her money. Okay okay, we're good. We're good. I thought she. I thought she took all my dollar bills. Please uh forgive me. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be the wrapping up of episode number one. I know it's kind of an awkward spot, but we will be back on uh Wednesday with episode two. And with that being said, guys, thank y'all for all the love and support that has been shown so far. Thank y'all for voting on who our starter is. And uh, if y'all want to, first person that comments on this video, comment a nickname, and that will be the nickname for one of our next uh, Pokemon that's coming up into the challenge. I am recording three episodes at a time, so don't don't yell at me if uh, I see a comment and then, you know, it's not chosen. Give me a couple episodes, and then I promise we'll get you in here. But, ladies and gentlemen, with that being said... Please make sure you hit a the thumbs up on the channel. Please um, sub to the channel if you have not. Subs are free and it helps uh, tremendously. Also, thank you all for everything. And until next time, bye.